Hello everyone, welcome back. Uh, another drive along here. It's been a couple hours at the pool with my number two. We have swimming today. Uh, I got a let me drive around. Oh. Let's just drive around real quick, show you what I'm talking about. There's the kids park, there's the swimming pool, just got out, really nice today. Got here early, before anybody else. A couple of people did come, it's, it is warmer, it's, it's that, getting that type of, you know, humid, warm weather. The, hum the humidity really traps that heat, so it, even though it's like only 80 degrees, Feels like uh, 90. Anyways, and yes, I, I wore I wore my I did wear I did wear the vest, and I also wore my buff as well as well as the high visibility hat. Some people thought I was a lifeguard. Anyways, it is whatever it is. It is whatever it is. I put some suntan lotion on my legs. I, I really don't like suntan lotion. I don't like the greasy like lotion it. feeling, you know, oily feeling that it gives. So I'd rather just not use it. But I did use it on my legs. I did. Ha I do have my swim uh, swimming trunks on. So mostly around the knee, a little bit above the knee and below the knee. Everything else, I, I didn't even, I didn't really put suntan below that because my feet were in the water and I'm wearing my Crocs and they're wet right now but that's all right it feels good oh, it feels really good I really like those Crocs I'm glad I bought them the problem was you know the thing about buying apparel is you get to buy them while they're in stock because they may not come into stock during the summer or they're maybe out of stock during the summer because everybody buys them up during that time so if you want to get your good apparel the one that fits you probably want to buy you probably want to buy the one that uh, uh, buy them early if you can you'll, you'll pay like full price by the time you get the sales price like summer is over and you're not gonna wear them for like a year. That's the problem with with that. So, uh, so I personally like the best. I may like, you know, weird people out just a little bit. Some of the construction workers around there were looking at me and kind of laughing. But the uh, reality is, uh, it works for me. And I'm pretty sure when, uh, well, at least I'll have some peace of mind that what I'm wearing can protect me against uh, bullets, at least handgun, handgun bullets. So let people laugh. You know, when it comes time where you might, it might actually save your life or even knife protection, you know, or, or even shrapnel. So when it comes time for that, I mean, let, let other people laugh. Like, people laughed at a lot of great, great people in the world. People made fun of, you know, Darwin. Uh, the idea that, or even Isaac Newton. Or who else? Who else? Well, a lot of people. A lot of people. I mean, just to show you the, the common wisdom. Uh, I'm getting uh, oof. I'm getting a little itch in my nose here. I better put my buff. Just I'm putting the buff just over my my mouth uh, and over my nose. Not over all my face, but there we go. I'm, there's really good use for this buff. 
there's no doubt about it. I mean, it looks funny, it looks strange. People may think it's all weird, but, uh, you know, when it comes to, for me, I'm not, you could say I'm not into quote unquote style, but reality is, you know, all I know if it works, I'm gonna do it. So that's what I'm into. I'm into things that work. Of course, a lot of people do things that don't work and then, you know, they waste the time and money. A lot of people do those things. They waste a lot of time. They waste their whole life. Find out what's what's important in life and what's not. And by the time they find out, unfortunately, it's a little too late. Well, I guess it's never too late, but you wasted a lot of time. A lot of time. That's just my opinion. I mean, for what it's worth. What do, what do I know? I mean, I, I don't work, I haven't worked in 10 years. I mean, why should anybody listen to me, right? I mean, I haven't worked in 10 years. I'm, I just, I'm a, I'm a stay at home dad. I must have, I must have less value in, to society for being a stay at home dad. I guess I'm more valuable, or the perception of value is, is higher if I like worked or did something like, you know, employment. Or maybe if I like actually own my own business. Yeah, you stinky your ear? Okay. So. Just got a little dusty from people mowing the grass. I try not to use the air conditioning too much. That's why I try to use the, uh, just roll down the windows. But when it gets really, really hot, I mean, yeah, don't worry, I'll be using the air conditioning soon enough. If I could uh, just cut down, if you can just reduce your consumption, energy consumption, I don't know about food consumption, but just consumption in general, you save more money, all right, you, uh, well, you save more money, that means you'll have more money, so you don't have to work and, you know, all your, the rest of your life, but also, you know, environmentally, I mean, it, you, you um, have a lower, quote-unquote, lower footprint, but I doubt it. Energy is already burnt, so product is already there, it's already made, so... Anyways, but if you can reduce it for yourself and use less energy, then, then good for you. That means more money in your pocket, that means you could uh, drive farther, you can, you know, I'm talking about gas-wise, drive farther, you can eat longer, you can live longer, you'll have more money, you can use your money longer than your uh, other co cohorts, your the other people in the world. A lot of benefits of reduce, reduction. And then reuse uh, also is a big benefit. I talked about that before. Recycle, I don't know about recycle. I mean, you're just delaying the inevitable, but, uh, or you're just transferring you're just transferring that liability to someone else when you recycle like you're selling your old clothes you just transfer that liability to someone else that's what you really do so this whole this whole emphasis on recycle you know I, I unless unless it's really truly being recycled but you know unless it's a metal a plastic paper metal plastic paper what else? Those general things don't, you know, clothes don't get recycled, unfortunately. Clothes don't get recycled, okay? They get reused and eventually thrown away. So paper, metal, plastic, what else can be reintroduced back into raw material? Glass, but there's a cost. 
it's a cost to, to, to recycle glass, so it doesn't really benefit you, but, but it is helpful. It is helpful. Glass is another one. Actually takes, glass actually takes more energy to recycle, so that's another reason. That's why you pay five cents or, I don't know, if you if you were in one of those states that charge you for, for those bottle, you pay five to ten cents or ten, whatever. That's why you're being charged per bottle for that. Anyways, I enjoyed my day. I immensely enjoyed my day. I spent time with uh, my number two. Went to the pool, got my foot wet. More people are going to the pool, it's warmer. So, rode the bike today. Man, I did not go to the fitness center and, and lift weights. But as soon as I go home, I'll probably use more of the uh, Compact uh, Sport Elite. I'll probably uh, do a back massage. And uh, um, what other part of the body can I work out that I usually don't work out? You know, uh, probably, probably um, the muscles in front of your shins, your feet, your feet, uh, you know, your hands. Oh, I got, I'm feeling kind of sore. Um, and then maybe I'll do my back a little bit and my stomach. Definitely uh, use do the stomach thing again. Work out my abdomen. I'll take a look at the guide and see what they got going on. So just things that you don't normally work, work, work out, but it, it would help to exercise those muscles. So anyways, I'll see you later. Bye.